Hello. Today we are going to discuss the five step process that we use to give lymphocyte immunization therapy at our centers that is Dr. Rao's Centers for Reproductive Immunology. I am Dr. Mohan Rao, a gynecologist and clinical reproductive immunologist and we have our centers Dr. Rao's Centers for Reproductive Immunology in different parts of India and at these centers we treat couples with unexplained repeated miscarriages, recurrent implantation failures or IVF failures and unexplained infertility using immunomodulatory treatment of lymphocyte immunization therapy and other immunomodulatory treatments. So today, as I said, we will see about the five step process that we follow in administering lymphocyte immunization therapy and how these five steps make it very convenient for the couples to undergo this important process. The first step of this five step process is the online consultation. Now, the first step of consultation can be done uh, either in person if the patient is in the city of Mumbai, but if the patient is outside Mumbai, then an online consultation is planned by our team. And when the patient contacts or patient's doctor contacts us within 24 to 48 hours, we arrange an online consultation. Now, this consultation is usually uh, uh, maybe a video WhatsApp call or even a Zoom call if the patient is comfortable with it. And with this video consultation, all the factors related to lymphocyte immunization therapy are discussed. We discuss about why we consider lymphocyte immunization therapy in a, a case who has either miscarriages or IVF failures or infertility, how we come to know about the diagnosis about different investigations that are done, they are, they are explained to the patient and how the treatment of lymphocyte immunization therapy is given at our center is explained to the patients. So with this consultation, patient gets a complete idea about lymphocyte immunization therapy and what the patient is going to undergo if patient requires this uh, process of lymphocyte immunization therapy. So after the first step of consultation, the second step of this five step process is the uh, investigations or doing the diagnosis of uh, immunological factor using investigations. Now investigations are done by different labs, all major labs across India do these investigations. We have seen to it that these investigations are set up at all these uh, laboratories and the patient is advised as to uh, the convenient lab uh, which is there at, uh, at their city or town where they can go and do the investigations. Many a times, because these investigations are specialized, the lab personnel may not be aware exactly which test to be done. And for that also, we have uh, support from our center, from our staff, or sometimes even the uh, patients or the laboratory personnel contact us to know more about these tests and we see to it that the right test is done for the patient so that patient doesn't have to give blood samples again and again for uh, the correct diagnosis. So this is a very important step and therefore we focus a lot on the correct investigations being done and usually the reports take a week for uh, the uh, for to come and we, if required sometimes we also uh, coordinate with the lab to get the reports early especially if the uh, patient uh, wants to undergo further treatment uh, very soon or if the patients are from out of india when when they are going to stay in india for a short duration then we see to it that the reports are available even earlier so that if the patient requires lymphocyte immunization therapy, then patient can be given at the earliest. So in the second step, we have the investigations ready. Once the investigations are ready, we ask the investigation to be sent to us. So the patient sends these investigations to us and in the, uh, and the investigations are discussed with the patient. Again, a follow up call is uh, arranged, a video call like a WhatsApp video call or a Zoom call 
the couple is explained about these investigations their uh, interpretation and whether they indicate that lymphocyte immunization therapy will be beneficial in that particular case at the same time these investigations are also conveyed to the referring doctor and the interpretation is discussed with the doctor also so that the doctor is also aware that his or her patient will require lymphocyte immunization therapy or will not require lymphocyte immunization therapy so that he also can plan he or she can plan for the treatment for the patient so this is the second step of investigations then comes the third step the process of giving lymphocyte immunization therapy itself now the process of lymphocyte immunization therapy as we do in our center is specialized it's a patented process and it is branded as immulit or immu lit now this immu lit is a one time 3 hour process and the uh, specific part uh, special part of this process is done by uh, uh, by us only that is by dr mukda raut or dr me who both of us are the only two qualified clinical reproductive immunologist in india and so we see to it that in all centers wherever our centers are whether it be mumbai pune nagpur delhi hyderabad or bangalore we are personally there to perform that critical part of the process so that the uh, process is uniform at all centers and the results are also uniform at all centers so that our patients can do this investi this treatment at any center so once the uh, need for lymphocyte immunization therapy or immunity is fixed or it is known that patient requires it then we offer the patient uh, to uh, uh, come to a center that is convenient to him or her uh, so there are patients who are, who have done online consultation from remote place if they have delhi as the nearest center they come to delhi for the procedure those who are near hyderabad will they will come to hyderabad so accordingly their appointments are planned and because our dates of visits to these centers are fixed so accordingly appointments are given to the patient for those dates and then on those dates the patients come and get the process uh, procedure done uh, at the respective centers as i uh, told you the procedure is a one time 3 hour process the patient uh, or the couple does not require much preparation prior to the procedure and even after the procedure then they don't require special care or rest so they can even travel to their own town or city immediately after the procedure and uh, uh, they get the personalized uh, treatment at these centers with us so this is the third step where we do the immunate procedure now comes comes the fourth stage and that is the stage of follow up now in this stage of follow up the couple is asked to uh, interact with us after a week patient need not come again to see us in person but we would like to see the immunological reaction uh, after 7 days so we have an interactive uh, either on whatsapp message or whatsapp call the a follow a uh, follow up call the patient is advised regarding the further uh, treatment the couple is told to inform us when the couple would like to plan pregnancy subsequently the couple is advised to plan pregnancy after a period of 4 weeks from lit and the effect lasts for almost 18 months so when the couple plans the uh, plans the pregnancy that is either they try naturally or those who require ivf they undergo say I, uh, embryo transfer we ask them to inform us beforehand because then we share a in an individualized plan of immunomodulatory medicines for that couple and we share it with their referring doctor as well as to the patient so that the uh, patient can take these medicines under supervision of their doctor the second part of the follow up is after the uh, uh, pregnancy planning when the couple conceives when the patient conceives and the beta hcg comes positive we always instruct them to inform us immediately beforehand so that Uh, the uh, cu couple can be given further modified plan of immunomodulatory medicines to be taken during pregnancy again this is shared with the referring doctor and then the uh, the couple takes these medicines 
during pregnancy. In throughout this process, that is while planning pregnancy and during pregnancy, we are in touch with the referring doctor as well as with the patient. And we see to it that the, the patient gets the required immunomodulatory medicines or any change if it is required any time that change can be done. It is very important uh, part of the treatment, the stage three of uh, immunate process and stage four of the follow-up uh, medications, immunomodulatory medications after the LIT procedure. So after the fourth stage, the couple takes this treatment and that fourth stage ends in a successful delivery and which leads to the fifth stage, the most enjoyable or important stage and that is enjoying the parenthood. Yes, everything, all this is done for stage step five and to reach that step five, we have to go through these stage from one to four in the right way so that the couple can fulfill their dream of having their own baby. And after going through such a traumatic history or of miscarriages or IVF failures, this is stage five is the stage of celebration and therefore it, uh, it is the most important stage. So, as I said, the entire LIT process is divided into five stages. In, I will briefly uh, re uh, tell them again. The stage first stage is the consultation, which may be in person or online. Uh, step two is the investigations, which are done in the respective city or town, and the reports are discussed with the patient and the referring doctor. Step three is the actual process of giving lymphocyte immunization therapy or immu LIT treatment at our one of our centers. And this is done by uh, us, that is by Dr. Mugda and Dr. Mohan. Step four is the follow-up with immunomodulatory medicine. And step five is enjoying the parenthood. So you must have understood that lymphocyte immunization therapy is not a complicated process. It's a relatively simple process. It does not involve anesthesia, there are no injection, no, there are no uh, surgeries, no cut, uh, no post-operative uh, rest. So that way it's an easy procedure. And the way it is done at Dr. Rao's Center for Reproductive Immunology, if you get the best of treatment of the most qualified doctors, a one-time three-hour process with a success rate of close to 80%. So I uh, tell again to all the, those who call those couples who have been suffering with so-called unexplained miscarriages or IVF failures or recurrent miscarriages to think about lymphocyte immunization therapy, to discuss this with their doctors and to our doctor friends, I would say they can get more information about this procedure. If required, we can uh, be of help to them and see to it that their patients get the benefit of uh, the immunomodulatory treatment of Immulid and help them have their own baby. Thank you so much.